We're going to start by adding a video and looking at some of the cool video editing tools available in Slideshow 10. We can use the zoom bar on the timeline to see the individual frames of the video. If you want to see a particular scene, drag the playhead to the right spot on the timeline and use the play from here button. There are many tools that you can use to make your video shorter or to cut parts out. To cut out the beginning of the video, position the playhead to where you want your result to start. Then click on the scissor symbol to the left and the clip will be split. Now we've got two video objects. We can mark the first one and remove it with the delete key. Alternatively, you could also just adjust the start time so that the clip starts from the point that you want it to. So that the video object in the timeline reflects the new duration, just click on the duration once. You can also make the video shorter by reducing the overall duration in the properties toolbar. Or by clicking on the end of the video object and dragging it to the left. You can also use the scissors tool to cut out middle sections. To cut out entire sections, click on and split the playhead. Select the start and end positions. And the selected section can be removed by clicking on the cropping tool. With a split playhead, you can also remove the beginning or the end frames. For this, you click on the scissor symbol, left to cut the beginning, right for the ending. To close a split playhead, click on the X symbol on the outside. You can also slow the video down or speed it up. For a slow motion effect, mark the video object and decrease the value of the playback speed. To create a time-lapse effect, increase the value of the playback speed. 